Anna, it's good to see you back so soon. Well, I'm glad to be here instead of being chased by violent maniacs. Stacy and I will complete preparations for Victor's revival, but we need your help restoring the generator unit and the other equipment. This will help you find some spare parts. There should be some in the laboratory. Okay, hold on a second. You're giving me a happy rainbow to find parts to bring somebody back to life? That makes sense. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> It's it's a happy rainbow. Great. That that should help that should help bring Victor back to life. Okay. I love it. Let's let's do this. It it goes right here. Wow. Ah. Solve that puzzle really really quickly. I need to open this door somehow and uh, I don't think I have anything to open the door yet. So is there anything else I can look at here? I haven't been to this room yet. This is all new information to me. So we need to put fuses into place for a, a lever puzzle, or maybe it's a fuse puzzle. Stacy, meanwhile, is working on this. This needs an amulet. Uh, crystals, right, he lost a crystal. Great, okay, so we need to find the last crystal. And I think, oh, no, I, I thought that was it, but the game says no. The game says there is obviously an angel amulet there that you missed, you silly. Okay, so this this is the upstairs part of the uh, area. Okay, good. Good to know. And let's see. I don't have anything to do in the lab quite yet. Right, we have these things. Okay. It's been a while since we were last in this area. Okay, so I have a bullet now. And that totally looks like a flying angel thing. I, I, like, I think I would use my angel there. Okay, so now I have a bullet. What can I do with it? Uh, I, I use my bullet here. I... I use my scalpel to cut off those things. What are those things? Cordite, I have no idea what that is, and string. And I need some chemicals here, okay? Well, I need string. I'll use string to maybe pick that up. No. Ugh. Game, you're, 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 you're killing me here. So I'm going to set off the cordite. I still don't know what cordite is. That gives me a fuse, right? And then it gives me the mask. No, it gives me a cylinder. So I needed the cylinder. Oh, gosh. Why am I not remembering? I needed a cylinder on the side of this machine. Yes. But I also need the chemicals. I also need some chemicals. So the mask goes over here. That gives me the rather large crystal. So let's, um, what's this? Electrical devices. Oh, I need to fix the electrical devices here to fix everything out. Okay, so a tool to pull things out safely. Do I have one? I have pliers. Okay, that needs a fresh battery. And this is the Hypercube amulet. So Hypercube maybe goes there. Yeah, so that gives me more items. I have a magnet and I have a disassembled lamp. So I need some fuel. I have some fuel, right? That's what this thing is, fuel. Yes, okay, so now I have a blowtorch. Wonder what I'm gonna destroy with the blowtorch. I don't know. And the magnet is gonna go with the string. Now we have a magnet with string. Okay, so crystal obviously there. Ooh, we're still missing one crystal. Still missing one crystal. Oh dear, okay, well that's not so good. Okay, the two angels go here. Butterfly goes there, uh, once I can get that butterfly. Um, this is where I use the, the magnet on the string. So is this a difficult puzzle or is this a really simple puzzle? Just move. Move your magnet over those things. So let's see, I'm making a butterfly. Yes. Yes! Hooray! And I need something to scare away that angry mob. I don't see that angry... I don't even see an angry mob. Well, don't worry, there's an angry mob maybe at some point. I, I don't like that. I don't like the sound of an angry mob. Okay, there's a chemical. 
And there's Icarus. Hey, Icarus. So I need more chemicals? More chemicals. Now, where would Icarus go? Hmm. Not sure. We finish this. We finish that. Oh, Icarus goes. Yeah, Icarus is the flying person. I thought it was an angel. No, it's just Icarus. There's a gun. Uh, maybe this is where the bullet goes. Open it up. Put the bullet inside. No, it needs a flint lock. Hmm. I guess we just open up the gun for now and don't put the bullet inside. So the thing that needed a battery was over here. And that gives me the capsule back to the tower roof. What are we doing now? We're taking a look at this. We are, we need to, we need to force this open. This is what the blowtorch is for. It's for a hidden objects challenge. Okay, let's see if we can solve this one. Um, whew. Okay, pick that up. Yes. Move uh, this lightning bolt there for an electrical ball. I wonder where the electrical ball goes. It goes there, replacing that. These things are broken, and this is a, a thing. I'm not sure what that is. Okay. This gear goes here. This goes there. I can I can find the things that easily match outlines. Those those are easy enough to find. It looks like we're gonna need several bolts in order to get that completely into place. Here's another bolt. And I see a key. Yes, I'll use the key here. I don't see what that gives me. I'll use a hint. Hint says bolt number four was hidden there. Now I get the bolts into place. Excellent. Plug that into there. I probably need another coil over here on the left. I still need something to, to fix that. Hmm. So what do I use this thing for? That's a soldering iron, fixes that. So now the power goes from here. Where does the power go? This, that goes there. Oh, I hadn't noticed that. So this is a screwdriver and another coil. I needed the other coil. Screwdriver's probably gonna unscrew these things. see that one looks like uh, it will replace it and then what are these Th those little little fuses Whew. okay so we fixed the fuse box now let's fix this fuse box so it looks like you want them all to be up is what it said you want all the levers to be up is what that diagram showed Here I'm trying the technique of going from left to right. Um, obvious, uh, I mean right to left. That's obviously not working. So left to right. I'll try that one. Hmm. Yeah, it looks. Yeah, they're all sort of connected in a slightly different way. So I need to find the one that moves like multiple things. There we go. Oh, no. There. That was it. So you wanted to get the one that moves more than just two. That's that's how you'd solve that puzzle. So now my, my, uh, my goal is to push back the angry mob. I still have not seen this angry mob, but don't worry. The angry mob is here. Oh, no! mages have taken over Victor's tower. They're bringing the dead to life. We must hurry before they curse us all. Anna, did you hear those screams? I bet Abigail is bringing people here to stop us and destroy the tower. We must stop them. Victor was constantly threatened, so he kept sleeping gas for occasions like this. Unfortunately, he didn't have time to use it. Perhaps you can find some. I found this, but I couldn't figure out how to use it. I hope it helps you. 
You really couldn't figure that out. It, it's right here. It's so obviously right there. It, it, it was within your eyesight all along. Come on, Emily. Try harder. Try harder. Well, the Axe's amulet was... Oh, jeez. It, uh, it was... Uh, oh, no. It was uh, over here. Okay, that gives me some stuff. Uh, it looks like I've got gunpowder. Ooh, gunpowder. Yeah, definitely need that for my gun. And now maybe I put the bullet in? Yeah, you needed to put the gunpowder before you put the bullet in. And the flintlock goes there. Great, now I have a working gun. Let's work out this. This is too tight to unscrew with my finger, so I'll unscrew it with a wrench. But what is it? That's got a bottle inside a bottle. Okay, uh, it's uh, more chemicals. Perhaps for the sleeping powder. Okay, let's set it off. We're gonna put everyone to sleep. You mess with the mad scientist? Well, I'll show you who's mad. <laughs> You're going to sleep now. Okay, we have happy people and angry people. Angry people, take that. Angry people, take that. Angry. 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 I think the uh, happy person in the upper left is actually supposed to be me. That's me. It looks like they could hit me five times before uh, I, I lose that challenge. So I pushed back the angry mob, and I looked fabulous while doing it. Oh my gosh, my hair was amazing. Ah. Okay, so the uh, two angels go here. Speaking of angels, I looked so angelic. Did I mention how awesome my hair was? Because it was pretty awesome. Oh, here's another morphing objects challenge, I see. So it looks like we're finding a lot of uh, weights and things like that, but some of the items are changing. So uh, they're morphing, as you can see. Just wait a couple seconds, and then the items will change, making it a little harder for you to find the item you're looking for. Ah, okay. There we go. That's one of the items I'm looking for. That's one of the items I'm looking for. Let's see if I can find the last one. It's down there. And this gives me some chemical essence. Chemical essence. I wonder what I'm going to do with that. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, I am shooting the chandelier? I didn't know that was a thing that you could do. So that gives me the final crystal. Final crystal's gonna go into place. Step aside, Stacy. Oh, and I need to refill the chemical too as well. So let's see if we can solve this. Is this a puzzle? It in fact is a puzzle. Focus the light rays by rotating the crystals. Ah, so just like those uh, levers that we were flipping earlier, when you when you operate one, it operates another. But that puzzle is easier than the levers puzzle by far. Stacy, no! Abigail, no! Oh, jeez. Okay, I thought that puzzle was a bit too simple, and and, and it was. So now we get a real final puzzle. Three pairs of matching symbols before the blue meter fills okay. Okay, so I need to get the three pairs of matching symbols. So, oh, okay, so I'm finding matching symbols. So I click on two symbols that match. Um, that's not a matching symbol. Those two match. Okay, three matches. Okay, got it. Um... This looks like a variation of the puzzle we had earlier, fighting that man who thought I was a witch in the alleyway. Okay. Yes. And those three. I wonder if there's more than three, uh, you know, pairs that you can make. Like if, say there were seven pairs on this screen and I only had to find three of them. That might, that might make it easier. Oh jeez, I can't see. Oh, I can't see. She's blocking the entire screen. There. Okay. Okay. Uh, almost done, I suppose. I hope. Oh no. Um, 
these two. Done. Take that, Abigail. Wow, turned her to stone. Whoa, and Emily's alive again! She's no longer half dead, half alive. She's fully alive, and Victor's fully alive too! Oh! Wow, Emily I was. I thought we'd name our future children after you. It's so heartening to know our family bonds are so strong that we even get help from the future. Who knows? Maybe we'll meet again one day. <laughs> we'll see. I think we've all had enough mysteries for one day, right? <laughs> well, I was gonna say, I thought it was a terrible, terrible idea on Emily's part to want to bring her husband back to life, but that actually worked really well, and now they get a super happy ending. That's great! That's great. Okay. So, uh, we do have a bonus game. We do have a bonus game, uh, right here. Uh, let's start the bonus game now. Obviously, I won't finish it <laughs> in this video. Come no. back and visit. We'll be waiting. Sure. Bye. Oh, my hair is so fabulous still. It's still so fabulous. Oh. And wait. Oh, no. As soon as I went back to the future, everything, everything, everything went wrong. Oh, jeez. Yeah, we kind of forgot to follow up on the fact that there were, there were skeletons everywhere. That's another curse. Hurry, we must go to my old friend's house. Nicholas is a talent alchemist. I'm sure he'll know what to do. Talent alchemist? You mean talented alchemist, right? Oh, no. Looks like those cultists found Nicholas first. No! Poor Nicholas. Is this shop on the corner Nicholas's? He could have a healing potion there. That could be true. Nicholas the alchemist. Nicholas Flamel, maybe? I'll wait for you here. Don't worry about my hand. It's fine. I promise, darling. Seriously, I was dead for like, you know, for a couple of days. Just having one dead hand, it's not so bad. It's not so bad. I, I can live. So, Nicholas, ah, oh, Faust. Nicholas Faust. Nicholas, for your own good, stop trying to find a cure for the curse. I will use violence. Yeah, maybe this was the leader of the guard, or, or whatever. The, the angry leader of the guard that seemed to be in uh, Abigail's pocket. So, maybe that's going to be the villain uh, of this part. Could be. Nicholas keeps the spare key here, and I'm just grabbing a bunch of items. I need to clean that first. It's too dirty. I'm not going to mess with it. Okay, in the alleyway is somewhere else I can go. Oh. So let's say I go to the... How do I go to the alleyway from here? Okay, so there. Th there. Okay. Okay, so I've got a sense of where things are now. Now to get from place to place. This box needs a figurine. That box looks intimidating. And I can't open that box for whatever reason. People of Grey Witch, abandon your bodies, join the souls of the unspeakables, and arise! Yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do whatever it is you're telling me to do, sir. That seems evil. This, uh, when I when the missing part is replaced, then I can uh, put it back. Okay, what are we doing here then? Let's see. The amulet doesn't seem to go here. The poker probably goes there. Okay, that gives me some forceps and a flask with water. I bet the water's used to clean this. And I pick it up with the forceps. It's a shiny helmet, and this thing looked like it needed a shiny helmet. And I need to find the sword parts. Ah, so I think I was trying to pick up earlier. It was actually a sword part. It wasn't, it wasn't like a puzzle. Okay, I need to pick the lock if I can't find the key. Could I maybe use the poker for that? No, no, that would be silly. Okay, so, uh, let's see. I need to pry this with something thin, not the poker. Then it's the sword. Sword gives us the, uh, symbol for sigma. The Greek letter sigma. That gives us the key to Nicholas's shop. Okay, this looks like a very good place to explore. Um, I want to go back over here to the alleyway. So clearly we're going to have to do something here, right? Okay, so we need to we need to get rid of the bird and we need to find a way to lock that. Okay, good. There's nothing we need to do there. Uh, everything we do now is here in the alchemist shop. Let me check the map. 
So this is the map for the bonus chapter. Looks like there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more places for us to visit.